since we know you just got moved up here, um, you've got a chance to pitch in a couple games. What's the biggest difference, if anything, that you've noticed between, you know, down in Boise and here so far? Uh, I think the biggest difference would be the, uh, the hitters are better at watching balls down and uh, they don't chase as much in the dirt, so uh, you have to have a good approach with everybody, whereas in Boise, and even college, you could, uh, you could get away with some of the hitters in the lineup, but here a lot, a lot of them have a good approach or they wouldn't be here. Right. All right. Now, um, I know that down in Boise you were starting most of your games, and here you haven't gotten a chance to start yet, but I mean, is that something that's in your future here, or are they going to keep you out of the pen for a while, or do you know? Uh, you know what? I don't, I don't know yet. They haven't really talked to me about it. Mm -hmm. I, I'd like to start, but honestly, I just like to pitch pitching games. I like to get out there, and, uh, and if you're in the pen, it's competitive at the end of the game, right. and it's all on your shoulders. If you're starting, you have to set the tempo and uh, go as long as you can, so either way, I like it. I just don't know exactly right. what I'm going to be doing yet. Anyway, as long as I'm contributing to the team, I'm cool with it. Okay. Now, um, what are some of the adjustments? I know a lot of guys, especially at the big league level, when they move from you know, rotation to the pen, there's some adjustments they have to make. W what are those adjustments, and how easy is it to make it, you know, on the fly down here? Uh, it's it's not too hard. Uh, a lot of the guys are, that are in the pen right now are mm -hmm. stars in college, and they're right. really good stars in college. So I think the bi biggest adjustment is uh, as a starter, you can ease into the game. Right. They're going to take first pitches and see, whereas in the pen it's instant action and it's coming at you. So yeah. you got, you got to be sharp early and you got to be sharp for as long as you can be. And as a starter, you can, you can ease into it. Okay. So, um, I mean, I know you didn't get a whole lot of time down there in Boise before you got moved up as far as, you know, the amount of days you were down there. Is it at all difficult moving from, you know, getting drafted to going to Boise to going to here and just making so many quick transitions? What's that like? <laughs> it's pretty cool. Uh, yeah. my, my parents had to uh, to Boise. Mm -hmm. and they had to cancel and fly here because <laughs> I got moved up. But I wouldn't trade. I wouldn't trade it for anything. Honestly, yeah. it's a it's a great experience, and uh, it'd be hard if the guys here were mean or whatever. Mm -hmm. and they, <laughs> They didn't like new guys or whatever. Right. They've all treated me with respect, and uh, mm -hmm. it's been really fun getting to know a bunch of guys. I mean, they're all chasing after the same thing I am, right. so it's good to be working together towards that goal. Okay. Now, one of the things that I noticed, you know, when you came up here, is of course you've got Ron Valone as a pitching coach now, and he was in the big leagues for a number of years as a lefty. Is, is there anything there that you feel like you can learn from him, just as a fellow lefty who's spent such a long time in the big leagues? I already have learned a bunch of yeah. him. He's a he's a great coach. I mean, he's watching every side. He's mm -hmm. watching us throw. He's not just like, I don't know what to say, bullshitting around yeah. while, while we're throwing. And he's just he's a, he's in everything. He knows everything. He jokes around with us. He knows when to be serious. And mm -hmm. I'm, I'm honored to be here with him because he was a really good baseball player. Right. Probably still could pitch. <laughs> <laughs> All right, great. And the last thing is, um, we've talked to a couple of guys, you know, through the minors so far this year. And they've talked about, or we've t kind of talked about how the Cubs have got this whole new Cubs way thing going on that they're trying to preach in the minor leagues. And there's so many changes going on in the organization. Can you guys feel that at this level? Do you kind of see that going on? Or is it, for you guys, is it just baseball as usual? It's kind of both. I mean, we yeah. can see it happening. And we're, mm -hmm. we're aware of what's going on and mm -hmm. how we're supposed to be doing things and everything. But honestly, we're all just trying to win games now. And I think that's the biggest difference is, like, I don't know how they were doing a month ago, but right. apparently this month they've been playing really well, and it's just a bunch of guys who want to win games, so right. it's been good being here, and I'm glad to be a part of it. All right, appreciate it. Thanks, man. I appreciate right. the time. Bye.